chair. Irish whip now. Big Ben took a steel chair wrapped it around the cranium of Bob Evans. And since then, these two men have warred. Scars on both their bodies tell the tale of what has been the most bitter rivalry in all of Eastern Pro Wrestling history. Bob Evans symbolically now taking out the trash. You know, Grayson Alexander, I consider you a friend. I consider you oh. an individual that that I have on my side, and I can only imagine what it must have been like that hot August night for Bob Evans to have who he considered to be one of his best friends in Mike Bennett wrap a steel chair around his skull and try and end his career. You know the thing, Scott, is I have known Mike Bennett for many, many years, but he has taken that a dark turn for some reason. But you, you, you can't argue, one of the top competitors here in EPW. As far as, far, as, far as I can see, listen. Somebody's gonna do this. Bob Evans is too smart for this. Wait a minute. What have we? We have seen the master of the double cross return to days of old. And Mike Bennett is gonna regret it, but I think he brings out the worst in brutal Bob Evans. Oh, the stakes are as high as they've ever been. If Bob Evans loses this matchup, that's a pony I don't want to ride. Mike Bennett going to be singing soprano after this one. <laughs> a sad, sad song indeed. Notice the shirt that Bob Evans is wearing, Slam Tech Wrestling University. That's what Michael Bennett, that's what Mike Bennett trains. For, for many years, Bob Evans considered Mike Bennett, as you know, Grayson, his prize student. The man that he thought when he was ready to hang up the tights and, and the boots, that he could pass the torch to, to carry on the lineage both of Slam Tech and, and of the, the skills that Bob Evans taught Mike Bennett. Mike Bennett threw that all away for foolish, selfish, envy, and pride. Wow. Spine Buster shakes the ring and the spine of Brutal Bob. Oh, man. Did you see the height that Bob Evans? Wow. Crashing down on the mat. And Mike Notice. Bennett, yes. Go ahead, Scotty. Mike Bennett. Is going for cover. Pinfalls do not count. Submissions do not count. You must put your opponent down for a count of ten. I am very surprised that this ring is still intact, especially from the stretcher match and now this. I am very surprised the foundation of this building is still intact. And we still have a TLC to go. This is vindication. This is why there is no comparison when it comes to independent wrestling. EPW is where it's at. You know, you said this before, Scotty Angel. We have seen the battles, the brutality between Brutal Bob Evans and Mike Bennett, but this takes a cake. 
you know, even to get this matchup, Bob Evans had a tough road to follow. Mike Bennett does have a series of very quick, very authoritative. No. The human skull is not meant to make contact with a table. And way, way too close to home on that one. We may become casualties of the war between Mike Bennett and Bob Evans. If they want to use you as a weapon, go for it. Why, thank you. I, however, do not volunteer. What do we got here? You know, several months ago, Bob Evans actually broke his hand while attempting to punch a chair into the face of Mike Bennett. That hand oh. didn't come into play here. Oh no. That chair oh, is no. about to come into play. If you ever wanted a Mike Bennett portrait, Bob Evans was about to implant oh. it on that chair. A bulldog, Bruno Bob Evans. Living up to his name. Given a bulldog to Mike Bennett. Th there is no padding on this floor. Two. We are seven seconds away. Keep in mind, if Mike Bennett loses here, he is barred and banned for life from ever competing in the town of Plainfield again. Oh, look at this, look at this. Pile driver. A move that's been banned in multiple promotions throughout the years because of its brutality and dangerous effects on the neck and the spine was just employed by Brutal Bob. Mike Bennett is barely moving. Halfway there. Can he pull himself up with the, with the ropes? He's up, he's up, he's up. Brutal Bob now going up oh, wait a to minute. the top rope. I'm in, I'm in this big, does not belong. Nope, maybe he thought better of it. I was gonna say, man, that big does not belong on the top rope. What is this? Body slam? Oh, what? Are you serious? Bob Evans There's says, no way. You've got to be kidding me. It's physically an impossibility. But Bob Evans has done the impossible and in the process broke his own body just to inflict torture upon Mike Bennett. Mike Bennett three quarters away and Evans just flies with a headbutt in the process injuring himself. You know Grayson, I have to believe that this war might not be ended until one of these men is out of EPW for good. EPW may not be big enough for both of these men. Oh, super kick. Now, Bob Evans has tried many times to use that chair in this match as a weapon against Bennett. Has failed every time. Bennett just out of luck. I would say it's luck with a with a super kick. Bennett's up. Evans down. The count is at five. All right, shot by Bennett now. Irish whip. Oh come on. Now now we don't even have now we don't even have an official. Referee is out. Championship committee or Rick Bauer, EPW president, if you can hear me in the back, we need another official. Oh. Ugly stick, but there's no one to make it count. One. Two. You know, from this angle, Scotty Angel, I saw Mike Bennett's face just get planted into that mat. Uh oh wait a minute. We, we must have had a power failure. I do know there are... 
What is this? Oh, wait a minute. What? Oh man, Alex Crowley, we haven't seen him in months. Last I knew he was under severe psychological evaluation. Alex Crowley returning to EPW. And, and he's the one responsible for Mike Bennett. Oh! oh responsible for Mike Bennett turning on Bob Evans to begin with. Alex, Alex Crowley, we've seen the videos intercept the messages. Somebody's going to betray somebody. What the hell is going on, Scotty Angel? It's just... It, it, I'm, I'm shocked. I am shocked. I, I'm left... I'm left speechless. All I can I, say, Grayson Alexander. You know what I gotta say, Scotty. I'm sorry to interrupt you. This way. Michael Bennett aligning himself with Alex Crowley. You disgust me, Michael Bennett. Nine. Wait a minute. M Mike Bennett just called the referee off. Oh. A, sep a second epic log. For what? What is the reason for this? What possibly did Bob Evans ever do to fill Mike Bennett with such vile, vicious, putrid hatred for the man who he once knew as his mentor? You know what? I can't. You know what? These fans are amazed. They're stunned. Their faces tell the story right now. Mike Bennett. I, I, don't, I can't even say it right now, Scotty. Nine. I don't even know how to put into words the pure rage I feel for what we have just seen. Mike Bennett has stolen the EPW television championship 